Hi everyone, my name is Kara Stevenson and I'm a fourth year PhD student in chemical engineering and I'm also part of the Graduate and Women Engineering Network leadership team. And I'm Sarah Lyons, a PhD student in mechanical engineering and a member of the Graduate Women in Engineering Network leadership team. Purdue created the first Women in Engineering program in 1969, when women made up less than 1% of students in engineering programs. 50 years later, 24% of our graduate students in engineering are women. The Women in Engineering program is a department within the College of Engineering, not a student organization. And our programming is informed by novel research in the field. The program is supported by five full-time staff members and by our leadership teams for each program. One of these programs focusing on the needs of graduate students is GLEN, the Graduate Women in Engineering Network. GLEN aims to provide strategies within a supportive community for women engineering graduate students to advance personally, academically, and professionally. The GWIN program provides participants with the tools and strategies they need to be successful in their time at Purdue and beyond, developing both personal and professional skills. GWIN seeks to connect students through networking, provides insight into career opportunities across academia and industry, and identify important resources to benefit mental health, wellness, nutrition, and other life skills. We promote peer networking and work to build a community that encourages and supports women and gender minorities in the College of Engineering. Our events and activities are designed to spark creative conversations, build friendships across departments, and grow connections between participants and speakers, many of whom are Purdue alumni. You can also keep an eye out for Access Alum events put on by the Women in Engineering program, another opportunity to network with Purdue alumni visiting campus. The GWEN program works to advance the community of graduate women in engineering by providing enriching events and competitive opportunities for travel grants. Additionally, novel research into the experiences of women in engineering is conducted by department directors informing the operations and offerings at the program level. To accomplish these goals, a variety of events are currently put on by GWEN. Our Lunch and Learn series brings in exciting speakers and facilitates student-led discussions on a variety of topics throughout the semester. Past Lunch and Learn events have covered topics from personal finance and healthy habits for graduate students to pursuing careers in national labs and in industry. The newly created Coffee and Conversation series, conducted virtually, seeks to provide a more free-form opportunity for participants to connect with their peers, including those who cannot attend events on campus. During the busier parts of the semester, we also host Bagel Breaks, a great opportunity for participants to relax with a bagel and their peers. Through Gwen, I found a space outside my lab to connect with other graduate students and explore important topics with a supportive community of peers. I really appreciate the Gwen program in the community because it provides me a supportive community outside of research, and I enjoy connecting on a personal and professional level with the other Gwen members. Graduate Women in Engineering, Connect in Gwen. In this network, I found so many like-minded individuals and even had the opportunity to find mentors. Gwen has been a really amazing program for me. It has provided me with opportunities to connect and network with some really amazing women within the College of Engineering. Additionally, it has provided me a space to grow both on a personal and professional level. Gwen really helps me feel like I belong in graduate school. It's really great to have this nurturing community of women who can help us overcome the challenges of doing a grad degree and also to provide tools for success. We hope to see you this semester, but until then you can send us an email or connect with us on social media.